I just can't believe the first Asian Marvel superhero is such a little <laughs> boy in social media. <laughs> it's inspirational, kinda. <laughs> I'm trying to be David here. Yeah, well, David. You're doing a really good, doing a right really right good David. Oh, Okay, and a lot of people wanted um, David to be here for this, but he's not, so we'll just do it anyway. We'll this just guy, be louder than we usually are. One of our followers, Nikki, sent this, and uh, it's pretty good. There's a thing that happened where um, an article was posted on Huffington Post. <laughs> All right. so, That's like, fucking great. So this is the, before we get into it, this is the name of the article. It just says, we love Simu uh, Liu, yeah, but it. he's not the only talented Asian thirst trap in Hollywood. Well, he could have been fooled. That's not Simu! No, I know. Exactly. Oh. It's an example of a thirst trap in Hollywood that's not Simu. So Someone, what happened? That's why they wanted David? Well, <laughs> that's why they wanted David so David could talk <laughs> shit. <laughs> the thing that's interesting is that uh, it's the way that like the guy who wrote the article posted it and added a quote from the article that says, I'm all for an Asian king thriving, but when a single actor gets the bulk of Asian male roles in Hollywood, it feels a little like tokenism. Mm. So he's inferring that- This guy's a fucking bitch. A lot of the <laughs> roles like... are going to the same Asian people. And honestly, Simu said something that was actually pretty spot on. He goes, way to attempt to put us against one another. What bulk of roles are you referring to? Are there movies I'm in that I'm not aware of? Do you think that there is a quota of Asian male roles that is a zero-sum game? Everything I have taken post Shang-Chi was not written Asian. We've been able to reshape stories to get more representation on screen, get your facts right. And he Some, does have a point. But sometimes he shouldn't respond. Well, he's gonna respond. <laughs> Simu's know, gonna say like, something. Oh my God. That's, such a long, that's such a long response to just like a little sentence headline. Yeah, it wasn't uh, cadets down mm. into the... Yeah, to the brass tacks, but I do like that he is saying like I'm not in every fucking movie like he's not Simu Yeah, he's on Shang-Chi, I mean, but like he's not but also no shit, right? Like of course he's not in every fucking movie Is he saying that like it's the same circle of Asians that's in every movie because well, I'm like yeah I mean that's the Asian Hollywood group who the fuck else are they gonna choose for me? It's like dude <laughs> one step at a time dude. We yeah, just had right. Shang-Chi Fucking like I don't know a year or two ago. Before that, the next, the last big movie was Crazy Rich Asians. We're making fucking strides. One step at a time. Stop complaining, you fucking little bitch. I guess what the <laughs> what the writer of the article, Ian Kumamoto, is kind of trying to say is that I think he's trying to shine a light on more unsung heroes within the Asian actor. Then say it like that. Yeah, why you gotta be a yeah. fucking entire little bitch? Why you gotta take us? down C-Move you know while why? saying other shit? You know why? Yeah. What are you talking about? Because this generates the clicks, baby. Uh, <laughs> it's controversial? Yeah, uh -huh. come on. Yeah, and it's He gets to include Simulu's name in the headline, and he knows Simu's gonna respond because Simu yeah, he has no fucking skin at he all. He the bait, yeah. <laughs> he takes it all, dude. He can't wait. He can't wait to get shook right. about it. But just the way that it looks where, like, <clears throat> if you're gonna say that quote and then put a picture of Simu, it's kind of like... Why are you going after that particular thing? I just can't believe the first Asian Marvel superhero is such a little bitch boy in social media. <laughs> <laughs> it's inspirational, kinda. <laughs> Anthony, you had something you wanted to add? Uh, I'm trying to be David here. Yeah, well, David. David's doing a really good You're doing a really right good, David. Oh, David's doing I mean, to me, there's more strengths and in, in, in just not talking to peasants. You know, like, kind of. you're, you're, I mean, Simu's exactly, achieved dude. such a high exactly. point. Like, do you see Will Smith commenting to, like, haters? Never. Will Smith I, might never. be a bad example. He did slap <laughs> someone. <laughs> but he slapped Chris Rock. True. He didn't slap some hater on the street, True, yeah. right? Imagine he did that. Oh, okay. that's, that's the thing that he's doing. That's what I'm saying oh, is, like, that's what these, these guys, like, Simu's achieved so, a very high pillar. When you're, like, royalty at this point, True. what are you doing? Fighting with peasants. Yeah, yeah. With Ian Ukimuru or whatever. But also <laughs> like, because uh, he's using his name to get some clout. Right? Oyster Kumamoto guy. Um, Oyster Kumamoto. It's not like, it's not like he's ripping at Michelle Yao for like 
bagging all her roles because she kind of always consistently. She took like, roles for a, like well, decades. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So Get after not, her, then. Right, yeah, he's not hating on her, and none of us are hating on her. I'm not saying anything bad about her. I'm just, well, what are you gonna be with Michelle? Yo, she's, I love her. She's so hot. She's killing it harder than Simu is in that same concept, but he's not hitting on her. You know, like so. It's like it seems a little bit just but really bitchy about this guy as well. But this, this, but this happens all the time in Hollywood, right? Like someone becomes like the hot thing and then everyone wants to book them. So then they get like, they secure five, 10 movies after that big hit. Same thing happened to a lot of members like, like in the past of like, or like, so for example, Cuba Gooding, right? When he came out with Hustle and Floor or whatever, or- Hustle and Floor? No, 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 fucking um, the other guy. Never. Terrence Howard. Terrence Howard. Terrence Howard. Okay, yeah, Terrence Howard. We, he kept going one after the other. He did have some, yeah. He, he, he got he got paid way more than Robert Downey Jr. and Iron Man. He did. Well, that's also that's also in part due to ten picture deals and things that people yeah. get behind the scenes that we don't even know about. Yeah. Like the, the Paramount about, Pictures will sign someone for multiple movies. The thing about Simu Liu is like he is a household name in a lot of ways, right? So it's kind of in the interest of the media to punch up. Punch, Are right? it? Yeah. Like it, it's that's kind of the thing, but right? Like, are, dude. These guys, like who we're talking about here, these guys get paid by the article, right? They're they're contractors, right? Or um, they're what do they what the fuck you call it? Yeah, non-union, non-contract. Yeah, yeah. What the fuck? Is that yeah, he, well, it does say he's a guest writer. Yeah, exactly. Uh, so like, they're not even part of a place. They're just trying to punch up as much as they can to get as much attention as they can to right. boost their own. And you can't punch too far up because then they won't reach back. Yeah. You gotta punch at something that you think is close enough because like And Simo like will said, respond to you're not, He's not writing about Jackie Chan No Right? Yeah. But Cause then, he knows Jackie Chan's not even gonna fucking ever respond yeah. Ever But he knows that Simu will punch back We all know Simu oh, will yeah. dude My little brother yeah. could write an article about Simu Lu My little brother is a fucking IT guy who lives in Missouri <laughs> <laughs> if he writes an article about Simu Lu, Simu Lu's gonna write like four paragraphs in response. Simu Lu will take three days to think of the perfect response. Yeah, and because Simu right now is the shield for Asian America. Like he's like He's the poster I, boy. I he's the face. He's the face. face. Captain Asian America. It's like insane kind of, though. He kinda that is. is. That was like he has this duty of like I have this duty to fucking say something. He, wasn't though. he in the NBA All-Star game? Like the, the oh, celebrity right. all-star yeah, game? Yeah, he was in the celebrity all-star game. Was. How many yeah. other Asian dudes were on the all-star game? None, I think it was the Just first him? one. Just him? I think it was the first one. <laughs> so in a lot of ways, he is like the, po he's the guy. And when you're the guy. And all power to him, like get your course. bag. Get of course. Bag. I think it's just like, yeah, like yeah. Steve says, or like I, I you already know he's gonna fucking clap back and that you don't need to do that. And they're working him. That's all, look, yeah, see, I got no hate for you, bro. I swear to God, I know you're watching this because you watch everything. <laughs> But I'm just saying, dude, like, you gotta just be you, bro. You'll be fine, bro. You'll be fine. Yeah. Just be you. You're top dog right now. Just be you. You're yeah. top G. You do. And, and by the way, when he responds to things where, where he's like, yeah, like, you know, we made like hundreds of millions of dollars, and like, it's crazy. Like, I'm it's so surreal, but like, but I'm the fucking man kind of also. <laughs> it's like, good for you. Honestly, that's fucking tight. Stay there. Stay yeah. there. Don't get down in the ditch with these fucking assholes. Exactly. Because they're benefiting off of. They're using him. Like frustrating him, yes. basically. They right, know they right, can right, rock right, the right, boat right, on right, him because right. yeah, they know right. they're rocking the boat on him. It's they're literally just it's like answering to the troll. It's like David. David's uh, rocking the boat with him. Yeah, and it works. David's <laughs> rocking the boat, dude. dude. It raises David's profile a million times. <laughs> He's writing coattails. That's not what it is. <laughs> <laughs> David sees what I see, and that's the thing. I'm a troll, right? Yeah. I see the blood yeah, in the water on this right. guy, and I know you can shake him and get what yeah. you want out of him. You guys. know when someone's gonna get their panties in a bunch, you want to poke Did you guys because. It's funnier. It's like making fun of him. Wait, <laughs> nobody likes watching anyone get dunked on on this whole channel more than that guy. His head is a basketball that our fans have turned into a meme of me dunking it, right? This guy right here? Literally, literally a meme. Beca and because we all get so much joy. Because I go home at night and I fucking write paragraphs about what I'm gonna say to Steve. And then I come here and then I blank out. <laughs> <laughs> I wish that was true, I do. I wish I owned your brain that much, I don't. But that's the thing, I know, you're, you're, you are, not you don't take yourself that seriously, and if I could give Simulu one, no. nobody should, right? You know exactly. Nobody Just don't should. take yourself On so seriously, side, though, bro. I feel like with Simu having so much attention, and he cares about the community so much, and there's so many Asians telling him, "You need to stand up. You need to talk back. You need to do this." That right? is true. He's under a lot of pressure. He's he under. He does care from about Asians. guys like yeah, us. We're like, dude, chill. No, you don't have to carry the weight of Asian America. 
You, that's not your job. Yeah, Put me in a movie. Right. I'll fucking carry some weight but, for you. But the thing is, he does, <laughs> he does have a lot of Asians telling him, hey, not only are you inspiration, it's your fucking duty to say something. Oh, Why are you saying something? you're the superhero. You are Shang-Chi. He's never gonna please everybody, right? Exactly. Yeah. You gotta just chill out a little bit. Right. They, Marvel hates you so much they didn't even give you a costume. Just chill out a little but bit. But by him being there, in a lot of ways, it just kind of sets the path anyway. Like just him exactly. existing by him being exactly. there. By he him, doesn't have to say anything. Him being be Simu Lu yeah. moves the needle so far that like he's he's the guy. He's the man. Like, uh, do you guys see that video of uh, Michael B. Jordan on the Creed set? Like he was on the red carpet or something, and this girl who he went to high school yeah. with yeah, yeah, yeah. interviewed him. And then she's like, oh, how does it feel to be Michael? Whatever the fuck, right? Ask him some questions. She's like, yeah, we used to know each other back in the day. <clears throat> and then he claps back on her because he remembers when her and her friends used to call him corny back in the day when they were like kids. When he right? had his headshots at school. And he's like, oh, like I'm corny, right? I'm corny. Yeah, you called me corny, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. And in your mind, you're like, Michael B. Jordan, bro, you are one of the Biggest stars in the world. One of the sexiest motherfuckers alive. You could have her contract killed tonight and nobody would even say a word. You, yeah, dude, you're the director, you're the star of this million dollar, hundred million dollar franchise. And you're like punching down on the, like, you don't have to say a thing to this lady. Like, you because already, you know, the, he called corny is nothing. Well, it's also, it's also because she <laughs> was trying to, and you're in high like, school, bro. She was trying to act like they were friends back in the day, like verbally to his face. Yeah. And he was like, you made fun of me. Like, For sure. You weren't my friend. I, but, wouldn't it be kind of more a gangster move if he just was Got like, her killed, yeah, that's what I- Got her killed, killed bro! <laughs> I didn't just do the contract her. killer! It's <laughs> even more gangster for him to go, yeah, we were best friends, they sleep together that night, and, and then he goes, but I don't want you. Oh, <laughs> that's gangster. That's gangster. <laughs> or, so kind of or, contract killer. <laughs> he's fucking her that night, right? Oh and then he's God, like, hey, he's a go. shit corny, he's a shit fucking corny. Right, call me corny boy. Call me corny, you bitch. <laughs> yeah. It's like, bro, you already won, dude. You're Michael B. Jordan. You know what I think it is? You're the guy. I think, like, for, okay, so guys like us who get it, we see insecurity while yeah. other people see empowerment. Yeah. They might see that and go, thank oh, you for yeah. standing up for us because they're weak guys yeah. that wished they could stand up and say shit, right? For us, I'm just like, I actually see strength and stoicism. So yeah. if these things don't affect you and you laugh, and not only do you laugh, you make fun of them, and make them look stupid, I'm like, that's not only a level of confidence, but intelligence and strength. Exactly, bro. You don't have to be like, actually, fool. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, that, that to me, it just feels a little bit like, oh, you don't have to. You don't have to yeah. take it so seriously. You little man. Yeah. Stop being little. Don't be little. And I don't mean he is little. I just mean he's acting little. Like, when you do that, you're acting smaller than you are. You've obviously done a lot of great things. You could talk about it. You could show people. I've done a lot of great things. Look at all this box office success that we had. All this shit. But then, well, you're acting little when you're, like, doing four paragraph responses to some peon and fucking gawker. Yeah. Like, who gives <laughs> gawker? I do. I, yeah. In this article, though, they do. this writer does say something that I'm like, God. It says, all we're saying is we don't want a predominantly white Hollywood to gatekeep sexy Asian male representation. What's we? And who's we? I don't know, but the main thing- That's is, him! The weird all thing I'm is, saying, don't say we. Yeah, the weird thing is that what this article is doing, it's doing what white media has always done to white Hollywood, which is divide opinions on yeah. people who are just doing good. And Absolutely. I find that weird. I'm like, Absolutely. you're an Asian writer doing the thing you don't want white Hollywood to do. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Oyster Kumamoto. It's the same game, right? right? It's the exactly. Game. They're still playing yeah. that same game in the same it machine. Works. They're trying to get yeah. clicks because at the end of the day, they got us. Right. They do. We got got, guys. We got got <laughs> by Huffington Post.